welcome to my channel and today I have another Easter haul for you. So today I've got a few things, I've got some things from Home Bargains, uh, uh, some from Asda and I've got one thing from B&M. Um, so I'll start with a thing from B&M, it was this tablecloth for our Easter table. So we always tend to have like a little Easter tea party at Easter. Um, so I need a nice little table cover and this is really really cute one. Um, I didn't need any Easter cups or plates or napkins this year because I've actually still got a few left from last year which is going to be plenty so didn't need to buy any of those this year but I did need a new tablecloth. I think this was £1.99, I can't quite remember, I can't find the receipt but I'm pretty sure it was £1.99, something like that from B&M. Next thing I picked up is for a piñata. I'm hoping to make a buddy piñata for Easter. Um, not started it yet, not even got the cardboard, so we'll see if it happens. But I've bought the sweets to go in it already. Uh, I think this was £3.50 from Aldi. And it's just lots of little Easter Haribo sweets. There's quite a lot in there. That'll definitely be enough for the piñata. I might put a few of the little chocolate eggs, I've got some of these little chocolate nest eggs things, might put some of those in the piñata as well, but yeah, there's plenty in there for the piñata. Uh, also from Asda I just picked up some little um, cupcake cases, they were 99p from Aldi. Here's a better look at the little um, cupcake cases that you get, so you get these carrot ones, and then you get these really cute little bunny ones, a little bunny on the bottom. Also from Aldi I picked them up some of these little chocolate lollies, these are 89 pence each, I got them a bunny and a chip each, and like I said these are 89 pence, these are probably going to go in their Easter baskets. Oh, actually from Aldi I also picked up some cream eggs, I can't remember how much these were. Um, maybe two pound not sure but just picked up a four pack of cream eggs and then the rest of the stuff is from home bargains so one thing i picked up was this little coloring book that comes with these little pencil crayons with the little easter um rubber toppers on this one was uh this was just 1.99 which i think is a really good price for a coloring book and pencils I then picked them both up one of these little paint your own money boxes. Um, I got them both a bunny. You did have a chick and an egg, but the chick one I didn't think was very nice and I thought they'd fight over the bunny because they both love bunnies. So I decided to just get them both a bunny so they definitely won't be any fighting. Uh, these were £2.49 each. Then I picked them up a bouncy egg. So it's supposed to be like a bouncy ball, like supposed to bounce. So the kids all love those playing them outside on Easter. I think these were 79 pence each for the bouncy eggs. And then I just picked up a few things for like making Easter bonnets. They already have bonnets from last year, which all the stuff has fallen off, which you can just redecorate this year. Um, but I bought a few things to put on the bonnet, so I've got some of these little felt bees, I think these are 79 pence, some little chicks, I thought these would be easy for them because you just peel off the back and stick them on, so I thought that would be a lot easier than using glue, so I've just got those, and I also got the bunny, so like I said I think those were 79 pence each for those, so then I picked up some decorative eggs, these were, I think these were about a pound, I can't see the price on there, I think they were about a pound for these little pack of decorative eggs. Picked up some little carrot, again they were 79 pence. I got a four pack of bunnies, they were 99p. I got a little three pack of sheep, they were 99p. And then I got a little pack of 14 little chicks and they were and they were 129 for that little pack of chicks. So that is everything in this little Easter haul. I think I've got everything for Easter now. I think I've got quite a lot of stuff, so I think that's plenty. Don't think I'll be getting anything else. I think that's gonna be it. Um 
I will be doing a video soon to show you what I'm actually going to put in the kids Easter basket. I'm hoping to make some little puppets for them to go in there. Fingers crossed. Um, I did make some puppets for them a couple of years ago and they've disappeared. I'm not sure where they are so I'm going to try and make some new ones for them. So hopefully I'll be putting some puppets in the little Easter baskets this year. Uh, so yeah there will be a video on that coming very soon so if you'd like to see that please do subscribe and hit the notification bell and you'll be notified as soon as that one goes up so like i said i hope you've enjoyed this little video if you have please give it a like don't forget to subscribe and i hope to see you again soon.